空、第3次防衛ライン突破、南アタリア島に向け、高速接近中、光る、エンゼル、アポロ各状態は、直ちに突入して、SDF-1 を防護せよ。繰り返し、SDF-1 を防護せよ。第3次防衛ライン突破to protect this vault with their very lives. It must remain sealed. Forever. Your money or your life! Why don't you say something? Yeah, who do you think you are? My name is Maximo. Maximo? The man who walks with dead. <laughs> What's that? Help me! Monsters are attacking my village. Please help us. What the? You're late, Grim. 
I always show up. In the end... Hey, buddy, it's been a while. Good to see you too, Grim. I've scoured the underworld, but Sothia's soul isn't there. Come to think of it, I haven't seen any new arrivals lately. Then Sophia's alive? Hmm, maybe. I smell a soul. The stone powering this thing is a stolen spirit, captured and compressed. Who would dare do such a thing? You're free now. I have to go find who's doing this. Right, and I'll go track that girl back to her village. You must rescue those souls! I'm on it, Grim. Here! If you need me, just use the coin! Thanks. Are you sure I'll be needing this? Oh yeah, I guarantee you will.
らの実はお母さんしばらく入院することになっちゃったのそこでだミラノしばらくおじさんの家に行ってみないか父さん仕事であまり家にいないからミラノも寂しいだろおじさんにはよろしく伝えてあるからね母さんが退院したらすぐに迎えに行くからなミラノちゃんおじさんはしばらく旅に出るよ留守をよろしくねうそーよしあこがれの一人暮らしお母さんびっくりするだろうなお父さん褒めてくれるかなやろう明日からはアルバイトだ
I guess I can start by thanking all my fans out there. Well, that's enough of the mushy stuff. I mean, let's get real here, huh? When am I gonna get some real competition? Come on, don't get silent now. Where are all the cheers? Hey, wait a minute. I'm your number one guy. I'm gonna remember this. Forces of Light have defeated Shinnok. Now, I must return to my duties as Earth's God of Wind. You have served your element well, Fujin. But we have a new mission for you. Raiden? Our battle with Shinnok's forces is over. I must move on to my new position as an Elder God. And you, Fujin, you must take my former position as Protector of Earth. Raiden, it will be my honor to succeed you. Take special care of the mortals of Earth. They are a great people, but have the ability to self-destruct. Be patient, and offer your wisdom and guidance. Farewell, Thunder God. I will not fail you. That is why I picked you. The war is over. I've once again defended my title as champion of Mortal Kombat and defended the realm of Earth, but I have failed to save the realm of Edenia. 
In doing so, I have also lost Katana forever. Katana? Yes, Liu Kang. It is I. But I thought you were gonna lick- With Shinnok's destruction, you have not only saved the Earth, but you've also saved my own realm. For that, I can never repay you. Knowing that you survived is all that I need. As heir to the throne of my realm, I offer you the chance to rule at my side. As King of Edenia, forever. I cannot accept your offer. I belong here on Earth as champion of Mortal Kombat. Then, I wish you good luck, Liu Kang, on all your journeys. Goodbye, Princess Katana. Come in, Major Briggs. This is Lieutenant Sonya Blade. Wha ah! Sonya, this is Major Briggs. Come in. Sonya, this is Jax. Are you there? It's over, Jarek. Shinnok is dead. The good guys won. You're coming back with me. Never, Sonya. I agreed to help defeat Shinnok, not turn myself into the special forces. The Black Dragon, live on! The Black Dragon died with Kano. You're the last one, Jarek. Never! Women's all Come in, Major Briggs. This is Lieutenant Sonya Blade, over. Sonya, glad to hear you're alive. You actually sound happy to hear from me, Jax. Things get boring? Not since you followed Liu Kang into the Nether Realm. Well, it's over now. I'm returning to base. 10-4, Jax. As payment for your loyal services, Quan Chi, I grant you the gift of your existence. My existence? Understand, sorcerer. I consume all energies, including the life forces of all that live, but I shall spare you. If it weren't for me, you would still be a tortured soul, rotting in the pits of the Netherrealm. You dare question me? I do more than question you, Shinnok. I challenge you. Then you shall die. <laughs> what? Your powers are useless against me. How can this be? I am in possession of your once sacred amulet. Years ago, I delivered to you an exact duplicate, while I retained the original. I even fooled Raiden. Now I am ruler supreme. And you, Elder God, are finished! <laughs> You are now a true Shaolin warrior. Thanks, Raiden, but I'm not interested in becoming a Shaolin warrior anymore. I've got too many of my own problems to deal with. What will you do next? I don't know. Wander the earth? Search for my soul? That kind of thing. Well, perhaps you could use this on your journey. Your lightning staff? It holds the power of thunder and lightning. Wield it wisely, for it can show you the way to immortality. You've earned it. Thank you, Raiden. I will not fail. Raiden, for many ages you have protected the Earth Realm from the forces of evil. You have earned your place among us. With your ascension into the pantheon of Elder Gods, you must choose your successor as the new protector of Earth. With the aid of Earth's mortals, I have once again managed to defeat Shinnok and his minions. I choose Fujin. He will guide the mortals of Earth as they move into the next millennia.
Follow me, Liu Kang. Raiden has asked that I lead you to him. What about the others? He has something special planned for them. Tanya, what's going on? <laughs> I don't know what Katana saw in you. Can't you see, Liu Kang? This is a trap! Welcome, Shaolin Warrior. Your Thunder God is beaten. Earth's warriors destroyed. You are the last remnants of the forces of light. Do you wish to beg for mercy from your new master, the Lord Shinnok? Never, Sorcerer! <laughs> Fool! <laughs> of your efforts. Now I wish to return in time to my home world before it was destroyed at the hands of Shao Kahn. As the new ruler supreme of all reality, Shinnok alone has the power to grant me this wish. You dare make such an impetuous request from your lord and master? It is a simple request for one of such great power. It is also not worth his attention. I demand it, if it were not for warriors such as myself. His attack against Raiden's forces would have failed. Perhaps you can convey your feelings to Shinnok himself. What? Infidel! You are in no position to demand anything. I could kill you with a mere thought. But we had a deal. A deal? I am not a god of my word, reptile. All deals are off! For millions of years, I suffered in the bowels of the nether realm. You, Thunder God, are responsible for my suffering. Now the piteous mortals of Earth will pay for my grievance. You turned against your fellow Elder Gods. You betrayed your title. You deserve much worse. But it's too late, Raiden. I win. With the Elder Gods out of the way, I will take my rightful place as ruler of all eternity. I can already feel the power surging from within. You're mad. Farewell, Thunder God. <laughs> By defeating you, Sub-Zero, I have avenged the death of my family and clan. Now my soul can finally rest. Your soul will never rest, Scorpion. The Lin Kuei may have been responsible for your murder, but your family's true killer still remains free. If you are not the murderer, then who is? I am the one you seek. To defeat my nemesis, Sub-Zero, I needed the power of a Spectre. You've done my bidding well, Scorpion, but now I must return you to the Nether Realm. Never! Your quest for vengeance is over, Scorpion. You cannot kill a dead man. You have defeated my physical form, but my soul is eternal. You will pay for the massacre of my clan and family. Well done, Sub-Zero. Like your brother before you, you have served my purposes well. I serve no one. Not the Lin Kuei, and not you. Scorpion agreed to fight for us in exchange for freedom from the Nether Realm. A deal I had no intention of fulfilling. By killing him, you saved us the trouble. Both you and Scorpion were pawns for Shinnok. Scorpion! No! Our battle is finished. You are now freed from my curse. Live well, Lin Kuei warrior. 
going somewhere, Jarek? Jax! I thought you were going to. Thought I was what? Dead? Like my partner you just tossed off the cliff? I'm I'm sorry, Jax. Please, don't drop me. Wait, I, I promise. Too late, Jarek. You can't drop me. You have to uphold the law. You have to arrest me. Wait, wait, this is brutality. You can't do it. Wrong, Jarek. This is not a brutality. This is a fatality. <laughs> of mortal combat have begun to tear at the fabric of the realms. The critical point has finally been reached. It was foreseen that combatants would one day grow too powerful and too numerous. If left unchecked, their intensifying combat would weaken and shatter the realms and bring about the Apocalypse. <laughs> gods demanded a safeguard be put in place to avoid total destruction. One that would make use of the combatant's insatiable bloodlust. Like moths to flame, they would be drawn to battle.
and old hatreds will be revived. Mortal Kombat has always been, and always will be. For millennia, the forces of good and evil have been locked in eternal battle over the control of Earthrealm. Some seek to use the tournament to destroy all that is good. Others seek vengeance, power, or eternal life. Time after time, each individual threat has been vanquished, and Earthrealm has enjoyed relative peace for many years. But there is concern that Earth is once again in peril. And this time, the threat of evil has two faces. It is now known that the sorcerer Quan Chi has escaped from the Nether Realm. Since his escape, Quan Chi has unlocked the secret of the ancient Rune Stone. Discovered the ancient undefeatable army of the long forgotten Dragon King. And most disturbing of all, formed an alliance with one of our deadliest enemies, Shang Tsung. With their combined strength, they plotted to overpower the only two beings who could prevent their total domination of the two realms. The first was the Emperor of Outworld, Shao Kahn. In a false show of allegiance, they sprung their attack. Then traveled to Earthrealm by way of a mystical portal known only to sorcerers and deities. There, they confronted Earth's mightiest warrior and champion of mortal combat, Liu Kang. It has been Shang Tsung's desire to consume the soul of Earthrealm's greatest warrior. Quan Chi's assistance, he achieved this goal. Liu Kang is dead. They have since returned to Outworld and are using the souls of conquered warriors to resurrect the Dragon King's undefeatable army. Should they succeed, they will have the means to conquer Outworld and eventually Earthrealm. They will be unstoppable. I can no longer stand idly by and watch this evil consume the world. I have relinquished my status as Elder God to return to Earth and lead you all to battle against our old adversaries. We must act now. We must stop this deadly alliance.
can stop it. Once again, our most cunning assassin and thief is successful. At ease, Lin Kuei warrior. Greetings! I see the ninja has been successful in retrieving my map, as I have foreseen. Let's get something straight. I am not a ninja. I am Lin Kuei. Scorpion was a ninja. Ah, yes. Your Japanese counterpart. How unfortunate that you happened upon him in your battle with those pesky Shaolin monks. Scorpion was tipped off. He knew I was breaking into that temple, and if he wasn't there, there wouldn't have been a battle. You are responsible for this sorcerer. <laughs> well, I've also retained Scorpion's services. In case you failed, I needed some assurance. Your peace of mind almost cost me this mission. Enough! Quan Chi, tell me, what about our payment? Oh yes, I... I almost forgot. The bones of your arch nemesis, and leader of Scorpion's ninja clan. <laughs> Our ancient foes, vanquished in one transaction. And I've personally made certain that every last remnant of their clan has been eliminated. Forever. You see, Sub-Zero. You can trust a sorcerer sometimes. Now, you will use this map on your next mission. Quan Chi has once again retained your services. This map you saw. It shows the way to a temple which predates man's recorded history on Earth. For thousands of years, the Temple of Elements has been hidden in what is now known as the Himalayan Mountains of Nepal. This map is the only evidence of its existence. Fine. I get to the temple, and then what? What's inside? A small amulet. Worthless to you, but let's just say it has great sentimental value to me. If it is so precious, why don't you get it yourself? I cannot enter the temple until the four elements within its walls have been defeated. And I am not on the best of terms with the gods of your realm, especially your god of thunder. Tell me about these elements. Well, they are the four elements which comprise the very existence of your realm. They are earth, wind, water, and fire. With your mastery of the element of cold, you have an advantage that no other human has, and that is the ability to defeat the elements. I have foreseen this. Shunax Amulet! Whose amulet? He is my deity, ruler of the Nether Realm, and soon destroyer of your Earth Realm. What are you talking about? This amulet, it is the key to Shunax's power as an Elder God. 
When returned to him, he will regain his powers and be freed from the confines of the Netherrealm. I thought Shao Kahn was the- Shao Kahn is nothing but a peasant ruler of a long dead realm! Shinnok is the destroyer of all realms, including Khan's outworld. Destroyer of all realms? You are insane! That amulet isn't worth the bronze it's molded from! Believe what you will, Sub-Zero. Goodbye, Ninja. Do you realize what you've done? I was just earning my living. Your clan's ignorance and greed will cost this entire realm. You'll now have to set things straight. Quan Chi could simply be a lunatic sorcerer. I never heard of an elder god named Shinnok, or of a place called the Nether Realm. You better start believing in both, because you're going to the Nether Realm, and you're going to bring back the amulet. We must act quickly. I have no dominion in the Nether Realm. You are reality's only hope. I'll do it, Thunder God. Only because I don't have a choice. Then stand back! This is the portal into the Nether Realm. Once through, follow Quan Chi. And try to get the amulet before he gets to Shinnok. I also have this advice. Beware the Brothers of the Shadow. The Nether Realm is a place for lost souls. If you fail, your soul will join them. As well as all the souls in this entire realm. He says, escape is futile. Who are you? A lost soul. The guard is right, you know. Where would you escape to? If you are here, then you must belong here. Rejected from your own realm, no doubt. I wasn't rejected. I was sent. Rejected or sent. You couldn't exist here unless your soul contained the impurities of evil. Haven't you ever tried to escape, old man? Escape? Oh, I'll be leaving this realm shortly. But first, I must play Raiden's game. Don't bother worrying about escape. Who are you? I am a dead man. But somehow you have retained your mortality, which would mean you are vulnerable to death. I am Scorpion. You killed me in cold blood. I had no choice. You could have let me live. Then I would be the dead one. But my clan and family would still be alive. What? It wasn't enough to kill me. You had to destroy every last remnant of my being, including my wife and child. You're mistaken. Quan Chi is responsible for their deaths. Words will not save you, Lin Kuei warrior. Well, he's definitely immortal. His soul is still contained inside his body. A mortal can't exist here with his soul intact. Unless Shinnok allowed it to be. I'll inform Quan Chi. The two of you continue to track him. Sir, 
A mortal has escaped from the prison of souls. He is headed towards the sea of immortality. A mortal? Yes, a mortal. With the ability to freeze. Alert the keepers and send a full garrison to intercept. Make sure that he does not cross the branch. The keepers? But he's just a mortal. Do not question me, Serena! And more importantly, do not fail! We have toyed with the ninja long enough. If you're still looking for the amulet, you can find it at the pyramid's apex, around Shinnok's neck. You've arrived a little late. I was busy. Don't you realize why Raiden sent you? The Nether Realm is a place for evil beings. You cannot exist here unless you were tainted with evil. You belong here. Join my brothers of the Shadow and worship our Lord Shinnok. Never, sorcerer! Then, so it shall be, ninja. Why did you help me? You are still immortal. That means you can escape the Nether Realm. There won't be anywhere to go if I don't get the amulet back. Take me with you. I've waited an eternity to escape. You don't understand. I can't leave you without this. Here. The amulet. Impressive, Sub-Zero. Perhaps you'll reconcile your reckless past after all. That's it? Not even a thank you? Thank yourself for undoing a problem that you created. Quan Chi told me that you sent me because my soul was tainted with evil. Is that true? You are a superb warrior, Sub-Zero. Only you can control your destiny. Not even the gods can alter your chosen path in life. Was that a yes? Or a no? That was a yes. But only you can change it. I vow to serve and obey the Lin Kuei. Welcome back, my warrior. I have a new undertaking for you. It seems your exploits have caught the eye of another sorcerer. I would like you to meet the retainer of your services. His name is Shang Tsung, and he would like you to compete in a small tournament. It's called Mortal Kombat.
Jax, we have an urgent situation that demands your attention. What's the problem, Gemini? We have a breakout at the Special Forces Maximum Security Facility. A group of highly dangerous superhuman criminals has escaped the compound and are at large. The list of escaped prisoners is as follows. No Face, Tazia, Jarek, and Tremor. They apparently are hiding out in an abandoned warehouse on the south side of town. There's something else you should know. The prisoners received help from an outside source. It has to be Kano. You guessed it. Gemini, tell Operations ETA 60 seconds to the warehouse. Inform Lieutenant Sanchez not to infiltrate the warehouse until my arrival. Affirmative. Oh, oh wait, hold up, Jax. I have a transmission coming in from Lieutenant Sanchez. I'll patch it through. Jax, we have just arrived at the location and we are awaiting your orders. Wait a minute. What the? That's a trap! Let's get that! Kano, you're gonna pay for this. Well, well, well. If it isn't that pesky Special Forces grunt, come to seek revenge for all his troops. I am quite impressed. You have managed to defeat all of my Black Dragon members. Pity. They were all looking forward to restarting our little gang. Little did they know, they were only pawns to slow you down. And in that respect, they succeeded. You're too late, Jax. I have already reached the eye of Shi Tian. And soon, you will know its power. And, <laughs> oh, delicious irony. You shall be the first to serve me. The only thing I'm gonna serve you is a steel fist to your face, you delusional maniac. And after you get your pounding, I'm gonna haul your butt back to prison back home on Earth, where you won't have the aid of this overgrown light bulb. Sorry to burst your bubble, Kano, but the only thing you're gonna lure it over is a porcelain throne and a 4x4 four four room. I know exactly what I'm gonna do with this thing.